You've heard the chauffeur call a few moments ago in this month of love and atonement, Elul. The prophetic reading early in Elul is from Isaiah 60. It says, Ki hine ha-choshech yichase eretz. For behold, darkness shall cover the earth. In Elul, we were told of Amalek, and Amalek is a special type of darkness. We remember how he slaughtered the enfeebled, the weak, the faint, the weary, the underclass struggling behind our line as we march from Egypt. We repeat in Elul, thou shalt blot out the memory of Amalek, yet thou shalt not forget, paradoxically. According to Maimonides, it is not just the Amalek of history, but it's the Amalek that is inside, that represents us. Inside each of us seeking position and security and perhaps power, there can be a trace of Amalek. And the poor, the uneducated, the unfortunate suffer from that Amalek also. This week, I worked all week in telepsychiatry and Zoom lines for the homeless, the black, the sick, the mentally impaired, the weak underclass of the poor and the homeless whom Amalek had attacked. It is the Amalek who still lives in each of us that is silent in the face of a destroyed huge underclass there because of race, illness, and misfortune. When I had a chance to work in Israel, I saw the unity of the Jewish people of diaspora and Israel as we saw to it that a huge potential underclass of Ethiopians and people from the communist countries came to Israel and they were given homes and jobs and health care and security as 1,250,000 settled in Eretz Yisrael. That's what the Jewish community can do. Now, the underclass, the victims of Amala, cry out to us, let us atone in this month of Elul. Let us blot out the Amalek inside. These people have the most danger from Covirus 19, from the very small minority of undisciplined priests who afflict them. May we use this month of atonement of Elul to bring about Isaiah's property, prophecy at the end of Elul. Isaiah says, Lo yishma od Hamas ba'artseina. Violence shall no more be heard in our land. Vehaya l'cha Hashem l'or olam. God will be before you in an everlasting light. Let the darkness, the choshech of Amalek, the suffering of the blacks and the poor and the sick, be relieved during Amalek, during this month of Elul, by our atonement from Amalek. Happy Elul.